In their meeting last Friday, the USM Faculty Senate voted 33-5 to pass a resolution to institute a vaccine mandate on campus. This follows the Mississippi Institution of Higher Learning's decision to ban IHL universities from implementing such measures on their campuses in September. The resolution passed by the University of Southern Mississippi Faculty Senate calls on President Rodney Bennett as well as the IHL to pass and institute a vaccine mandate. Other IHL institutions, such as Mississippi State University, the University of Mississippi, and Jackson State University have done similar resolutions in their own respective faculty senates. Dennis Wiesenberg, president-elect of the Faculty Senate, expresses that if more assertive action is not taken, the university could be in a similar position going into the fall 2022 semester as it is now. But, you know, the bigger fear is if we don't stomp out the Delta variant, there may be a one in the future that's much more lethal uh, that would change the equation entirely. So. Robert Press, chair of the Welfare and Environment Committee, addresses the need to look beyond the politicized nature of vaccine mandates. But I don't agree at all as a political scientist, as a person um, of, of letting politics rule over health. The, the facts are just not there. It shouldn't get balled up into people who want to run on a certain platform and, uh, and it just doesn't make sense to me. Even before the IHL's decision, the administration was against instituting a vaccine mandate. Dee Dee Anderson, Vice President for Student Affairs, mirrors this sentiment. I think it's always good for our constituent groups to voice their opinion and to do that in the appropriate measures and that's, that's what they're doing. I mean, that's the means that they have to um, appropriately share with the, with the administration, you know, what they believe should happen. Um, unfortunately, you know, I think it's pretty clear from IHL that, that that's not the direction that we're going to go in as an institution. Um, but I always, like I said, I think it's always good for our constituent groups to voice their opinions. Though the implementation of a vaccine mandate is doubtful, USM's Faculty Senate stands by the resolution with its firm belief that instituting such a mandate is the best way to combat the coronavirus. Reporting for SMTV, this is Garrett Grove.